For the all-new fourth-generation Sorento, Kia has transformed the midsize SUV from minivan-like proportions and design to more muscular, upright Telluride-like aggressive design. With a squarer silhouette and more assertive exterior details, the new generation looks a lot different than the one it replaces. Slotting between the award-winning Telluride and the compact Sportage, the 2021 Sorento looks to further bolster an already impressive portfolio of Kia SUVs. The Sorento has been a steady good seller, and Kia hopes this new fourth-generation model will capture some of the magic of its super-successful and slightly larger sibling, the Telluride. The new Sorento has been improved in multiple other ways. There are four efficient powertrains available including a new plug-in hybrid model arriving a bit later in the year. Additionally, the new chassis, with a 1.4-inch longer wheelbase, is lighter and stronger than before, while having increased interior room and reduced levels of interior noise. Also, for the first time, the Sorento will be available with second-row captain's chairs. The new top Sorento is the X-Line SX Prestige all-wheel drive, a premium model with an emphasis on technology and off-road ability. To that end, it has an inch higher ride height for more underbody clearance, plus a locking center differential and downhill descent control. This new top model also has distinctive exterior details, unique 20-inch alloy wheels, and a bridge-type roof rack. While some people may miss the Sorento V6 and its maximum towing capacity of 5,000 pounds, the added efficiency of the modern four-cylinder engines will be appreciated far more often. Incidentally, the maximum tow capacity of the new Sorento 2.5T is 3,500 pounds, while the non-turbo four-cylinder model is rated at 1,999 pounds. The Sorento Hybrid has a tow rating of 1,653 pounds. Exterior the all-new Kia Sorento has a modernized version of the company's Tiger nose, and the daytime running lights are lines around the standard LED headlights. Other neat details include the hood edge wraps around the body sides and blends with the shoulder line, making the Sorento look longer and wider than it actually is. What's more, a strong side character line adds some muscular athleticism, aided by a distinctive wave shape at the base of the Sorento C pillars. The wheel sizes range from 17 to 20 inches. Interior to complement the strong new Sorento exterior, Kia designers kept the theme of refined boldness in mind while crafting the all-new interior of this compact midsize three-row crossover SUV. To help that effort, they gave the six- or seven-seat Sorento cabin distinctive touches such as bright satin finishes, open pour wood inlays, vertical air vents, and even embossed diamond quilted leather in the top-tier Prestige models. Behind the third-row seat is this 12.6 cubic feet of cargo capacity, which increases to 38.4 cubic feet when that 50-50 split third row is folded. For comparison, the Ford Explorer has 21.0 cubic feet of cargo room behind its third row, as does the Kia Telluride. The Sorento's interior design is a big departure from the current version's rather bland aesthetic. The dashboard can be outfitted with a 12.3-inch digital gauge cluster and a 10.3-inch touchscreen infotainment system. The rest of the design blends rhombus-shaped air vents, integrated ambient lighting, and intricately stitched surfaces on the door panels and seat inserts. The center console hosts a rotary shift knob as well as a drive mode selector and other vehicle functions. A variety of cubby storage spots and cup holders also fill out the console. With infotainment and connectivity features at the forefront of new car technology, the Sorento supports all of the most desirable content. It comes standard with an 8.0-inch touchscreen or an optional 10.3-inch touchscreen. Along with a wireless charging pad, there's also an optional 12-speaker Bose sound system for those who prefer an upscale audio experience. Engine and Performance The 2021 Kia Sorento is available with four powertrains, all featuring four-cylinder engines. The base Sorento LX, in front-wheel drive or all-wheel drive form, has a 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine with 191 horsepower and 181 pound-feet of torque. Its transmission is a conventional 8-speed automatic with a torque converter, and the EPA combined fuel economy is 27 miles per gallon, a 2 mile per gallon improvement over the previous Bay Sorento. The new Sorento's all-wheel drive system has a locking center differential that provides extra power to rear wheels in slippery conditions. Next up is a turbocharged version of the direct-injected 2.5-liter four-cylinder that puts out 281 horsepower and 311 pound-feet of torque. Available in the Sorento 2.5T models with front-wheel drive or all-wheel drive, this engine sends power to the wheels via an 8-speed wet dual-clutch automatic transmission. The maximum towing capacity with the Turbo 4 is 3,500 pounds. EPA combined fuel economy is 25 miles per gallon, 3 miles per gallon better than the previous V6 Sorento. 
The new Kia Sorento 1.6T Hybrid is equipped with a direct injected 1.6-liter four-cylinder engine with 180 horsepower and a 44-kilowatt electric motor. It has a combined 227 horsepower, and the electric motor is powered by a 1-kilowatt-hour battery. This Sorento, available only with front-wheel drive and equipped with a six-speed automatic transmission, gets an impressive EPA-estimated fuel economy of 39 miles per gallon city, 35 miles per gallon highway, or 37 miles per gallon combined. If you want even better efficiency, opt for the new Sorento plug-in hybrid. This all-wheel drive model comes out in 2021, powered by the same direct-injected 1.6-liter four-cylinder engine as the Sorento 1.6T hybrid but it's supplemented by a more powerful 66.9 kilowatt electric motor and a larger 13.8 kilowatt hour battery. While we don't have EPA fuel economy figures for this new Sorento plug-in hybrid yet, we do know it has a six-speed automatic transmission, a combined output of 261 horsepower, and an estimated all-electric range of 30 miles. Standard features. Standard features on the front-wheel drive, base 2021 Kia Sorento LX include the 191 horsepower 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine, an 8-speed automatic transmission, 17-inch alloy wheels, and selectable drive modes that include comfort, sport, eco, and smart. The base Sorento also has LED headlights and taillights, plus cloth seat trim, a 60-40 split bench for three in the center row, privacy glass, a six-speaker audio system and an 8-inch touchscreen radio with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The standard Sorento safety suite is generous. It includes rear occupant alert, which won't let you forget a child or a pet in the back after you've locked the vehicle. It also has a forward collision warning system and automatic emergency braking. Also, the 2021 Kia Sorento has a driver attention monitor that will show and sound a warning if it senses the driver may be asleep. Other standard safety hardware includes a lane departure warning system and lane following assist, which makes small steering adjustments to keep the Sorento in the middle of its lane. Options There aren't many options available on the 2021 Sorento as Kia has decided to package various features according to the trim levels. The most notable option on the Sorento LX base model is all-wheel drive, which includes an extra snow setting for the driver selectable drive modes. On the turbocharged EX 2.5T model, you can get a panoramic roof with a retractable power sunshade. Price The new Sorento starts at $29,390 for the base front-wheel drive LX model and climbs from there to $42,590 for the all-out and all-wheel drive SX Prestige X line. Adding all-wheel drive to the LX, S, EX, and SX models add $1,800 to the price. Kia has one of the most impressive warranty plans in the industry with a limited warranty that covers 5 years or 60,000 miles, and a powertrain warranty that covers 10 years or 100,000 miles. However, unlike Hyundai, which offers similar coverages with complementary scheduled maintenance Kia does not. Summary The all-new 2021 Kia Sorento is a quick SUV. It has that strong, steady pull that you may expect from similarly powered turbocharged sports cars and electric cars. While the Sorento no longer has a V6 engine, the 2.5-liter turbo has almost as much horsepower and more torque. Lots of comparisons to the Kia Telluride are certain. Maybe you're shopping for a three-row SUV and can't decide. The Telluride, for the record, is 8 inches longer than the new Sorento, and it has a 3.4-inch longer wheelbase, so it's not that different in overall size. However, the Sorento feels smaller, nimbler and it's more fun to drive. The Telluride is a larger and more comfortable SUV with suppler ride quality. So, if you're looking for an SUV that's sporty and quick yet has the carrying capacity of a larger SUV, the Sorento is your best bet, while the Telluride may be better for someone that's looking for a smoother ride with the maximum capacity and dimensions. Trying to go the other